Shields up, Ironbreakers. How's everybody doing today? It's been a while since we've returned to the best game in the world, basically. And if you don't believe me, well, that's too bad. You're just wrong. It is what it is. They were going to be playing on, uh, on PlayStation 5, by the way, which is why you guys got the better uh, visuals on the stream. I mean, you're going to get the better visuals as soon as you get this ugly mug out of here. But we're still kind of like waiting uh, for the event itself to come. For those of you that are not aware, usually I start my live streams about uh, a half an hour before the actual events hit live so that we can all hang out for a little bit, talk about the event, talk about what's been going down. How's everybody doing? You guys having a good time? You guys been surviving the crazy pandemic? Cothler Boyd, what is up, dude? The family is doing great. Everything's going fine. Uh, my kids are still going to school. Our school's also doing good. So everything is doing just peachy. Just peachy. Oh, by the way, crap, I need to check something really quick. Let me see. Crap, I forgot to do this. I need to do this tomorrow. Uh, uh, actually, let me, <laughs> I shouldn't do this right at the start of the stream. I'm really sorry, but here's here's the thing, guys. Uh, let me explain to you guys why it's important for me to send this, this message right now. And I've been really busy throughout the entirety of today because I've been playing a lot of World of Warcraft, okay? I'm addicted. I'm addicted to World of Warcraft right now. I'm sorry. I know that a lot of you are disappointed in me, but I've been having a blast doing that. But um, I've also been trying to, to see if I could, um, if I would be able to get uh, Cyberpunk. And that might be a thing. So I just have to send this text really quick. I'm really sorry. But yeah, like I said, the, um, the event is going to be starting in about uh, 30 minutes. And uh, this is going to be a solo only event, is my understanding. So in order for you to grind the Milla costume and the uh, the armor that you guys are the armor that you guys are going to be able to craft, um, you're probably going to have to do it solo, which is kind of weird. I'm curious to see how that quest plays out. Uh, let me just see this. I hate, I hate addresses, dude. I'm terrible at memorizing them. I hate them. Where's that? I promise I'm not slacking. It's very important. Okay. Uh, sounds good. There. That's all then. Sorry about that. <clears throat> Ruri, is it hard to become a YouTuber? Uh, let me put it like this. The longer you wait, the harder it gets. Uh, doing what I do is not necessarily hard. I don't consider it to be hard. The hard thing is finding out, is finding like your niche, finding what type of videos you need to do when. That's really the biggest challenge for YouTube in order to be successful. Uh, but yeah, YouTube monetization. There is no pandemic on planet Earth. <laughs> Hit us up with some of that sweet, sweet Spanish, por favor. Ma, claro que sí. Pero que quieres que te diga? Vale. Todo bien? ¿Qué pasa? <laughs> I can communicate in Spanish a little bit. Uh, same thing with French. So, yeah. Geralt Leshen quest was solo. Only ancient Leshen wasn't. Yeah, but there's like, there's two quests and one of them is to actually grind a full armor set. Uh, so yeah, and also I think I'm gonna have to learn how to play dual blades. Like, that's gonna be challenging. I don't know how to play dual blades. Let me see, do I have any dual blades on me? Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Mr. Swifty, thank you very much for the souls. Tip of the hat to you. Appreciate support. Thank you. Thank you very much. <clears throat> I really miss your Monster Hunter content. Yeah, it's just there hasn't really been a whole lot happening in Monster Hunter. And, you know, there's just not a whole lot to talk about. I actually, I, w I was thinking the other day, I really would like to do uh, a podcast type thing. If I could convince uh, Gaijin to do like at, at least one 
like interview with Gaijin or something like that. I wanted to do something in those lines. I was also harassing uh, Sox the other day to do one of those. You just have like a Monster Hunter chat with some of the people that have been around Monster Hunter for a real long time. I wanted to do something like that, but I'm not sure if we're going to be able to swing it. Uh, let me hit up the training zone. Oh my god, I'm watching myself in the stream. Oh, are you in the are you in the hub? Let me swap over to gameplay. Okay, let's see if I know how to do this. First of all, swap it around. In jobs X and area. When does it come out? It comes out in about 25 minutes. And thank you. Appreciate the kind words. Dual Blades is super simple, especially with a new Wonder skill. Yeah. I'm just thinking because I'm pretty sure that Mila's quest is going to be like Dual Blades. So let's see. Uh, that skill that you guys are talking about, I was thinking it would be... Oh, it's not this. Oh, yeah. First I got to do this. And then... Ta -da 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 and... Yep. And... Yep. And we can go to this. And... The one thing that I'm missing... Is the aerial? Can you get the aerial from... Oh, wait. I don't have a pole now. Okay, let's swap it around again. You! Swap this! Wait, what? Oh, I have the sheet. That's right. It's been a while since I played Moss Hunter, right? Like, guys, I kid you not, I've been pressing World of Warcraft... Uh, the keys for my, um... WoW combo so much that my fingers are actually becoming numb. I'm actually losing sensitivity of my fingers because of how, how, how many keys I fucking spam with them. It's crazy, dude. Rui, did you play Assassin's Creed Valhalla? It's fun as hell. Uh, Skill Up would have a couple of things to say about that. I did not play Assassin's Creed Valhalla because fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, and I'm an idiot. That's, that's the way that I look at things. So Assassin's Creed Odyssey already fooled me once. It's not going to do it again. Okay, so you can do circle dodge here, and that will trigger the aerial, which can also go into, uh, it can also go into the Beyblade attack, and then it can also do it sliding. Is Rui using the weep sticks? Yeah, Dylan J, because I believe we're probably going to have to use them on the quest, so I'm trying to familiarize with it to just get a bit of a warm up. I hated Origins but loved Belhot. Dude, it just seems like more of the same Ubisoft thing, right? And I'm not about that right now. I really don't feel like playing the same Ubisoft game all over again. And I say this and I'm playing like freaking World of Warcraft of all things. Like, what do you mean playing the same old? World of Warcraft's even older. Yeah, I'm playing it with friends. It's a lot of fun. You gonna try the new Wilson update? Nope. That game died to me, dude. That game died. Maybe I will. I don't know, but I, right now I don't feel like it. Mm, okay. I should probably craft... I should probably craft, like, Fatalis' dual blades and just go to town on something. So I guess I'll not be able to beat this quest if I'm not able to use a weapon in it. Mm, I mean, she. if it's like the Witcher one, right? If it's like the Witcher one, they'll give you a couple of weapons to choose from. Oh, I forgot this came to my room. Oh, man, I haven't been to my room in a while. I love this music. Like, I'm not joking. I legit really like this music. The first time I heard it was actually in the room. I really dig this one. Do you guys like this one? Hey, does this update bring Safi Jiva for one player? That's a good question. We should ask an expert. Let's see. Oh crap, right. I can't. I was <laughs> I was trying to drag my browser window <laughs> into my console and somehow it didn't work. I wonder why. I wonder why I can't just drag my browser window to my console. Oh, oh well. But uh, I did an update video that talked about that stuff, didn't I? Yeah, Monsanto World December update. Here it is. Uh, let me just skip this ad here, and we can see. We're kind of here coming at you with an 
that he told us about this art. For those of you that now, uh, on top of this, the festivals are also going to be pretty much running back to back and they will be swapping every two weeks between craft VIP tickets, which is get those tickets. You can inf okay, uh, so festival, uh, the seasonal events. And the of us did while we were still like progressing. And some pieces of Kulturoth, you know that some, some more dedicated players will have uh, soloed it, but uh, ultimately for the regular hunter, you needed to have four people because the monster was scaled for four people and it was, uh, it was a very this is challenging what I'm talking encounter. About so uh, now you'll be able to go in solo if you want to, and you'll be able to kill him solo because his health is going to be scaled. And, and I say now, but I mean that when the event actually, when the, the patch comes in early December, because up until then, it says early December, so it might be this one. Uh, if I just said early December, it means it might be this update. Might not. So I'm not 100% sure if it's, if it's this update. Might be uh, a little bit later. We're playing multiplayer uh, Friday, December. So it's this one, Kegrin? Red Dragon. Yep, 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 yep. It's this one. It's this update, guys. What's the name of the music? Oh. Uh, Tales Spun Through Song. It's really good. I'm so confused, I thought he was watching a video. I am watching a video. I was watching a video. It was a video of myself. Because you guys asked me when the event was coming, and I didn't know, but I knew I had made a video on it. So I just checked the database. I hear I'm a, a pretty reliable source of information, as it turns out. <laughs> what if it's going to be a title update or a patch? It's a patch. It's 100% a patch. I'm actually curious to see how this goes, because right now we're on the PS5, right? So I want to see if the process is a little bit smoother on, on the PS5. So hopefully... That'll be, that'll be a thing. We'll get the, this time, Mr. Wada and Mr. Kegrin, you're not gonna beat me on fi Well, actually, Wada might, because Wada also has a PS5. Did you install this on PS5 yet, Wada? Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna be faster than you this time, Kegrin. You're not gonna beat me, son. <laughs> okay. Let's, uh, let's exit out of here and go check out, uh, see if I can craft Fatalis' dual blades just for, for giggles. You guys are cheaters. Oh, hell yeah, dude. Look, Wada already got it. How'd you like Demon Souls, Wada? Mila Jovovich. Yeah, dude. There's a lot of people, there's like legitimately a lot of people on the video where I announced this, uh, that were upset. Like, I'm not kidding. There were a lot of people that were just like... They would rather not have this event. I was blown away. I'm like, well, wh what do you mean? The, how could, how would you rather not have an event? Like, Jesus Christ, what's my expectation in your event quest? I don't know. It's like, look, I'm not looking uh, for the Monster Hunter movie to be something that like blows my mind, right? The Monster Hunter movie, like I've explained multiple times for me, it's a popcorn flick. I'm going to go into the cinema and I'm going to eat some popcorn and I'm going to enjoy it as best as I can. I just want to see the cool looking monsters and some action scenes. That's what I'm coming to, to this movie for, you know? Uh, we already know it's an isekai, so, you know, it is what it is. Still can't find a PS5, starting to get tempted to go to Scalper's Root at this point. Don't, don't do it, Antonio. Hang in there, dude. I know it's easy for me to say, but seriously, don't let those son of a bitches win, dude. Don't let that scum of the earth win, dude. Those people, those friggin' people who then are trying to justify their actions of literally hoarding PS5s, they're just as bad as like all of the billionaires of the world that are hoarding all of the resources and wealth of this planet. These people are just as bad and just as scummy and they'll get what's coming to them, dude. When Sony brings out a new batch and those people can't sling those consoles, they're screwed and I hope they lose a crap ton of money. <sighs> Screw them, dude, is what I gotta say, dude. Screw them. Scalpers are trash. Do not take... Actually, you guys know what you should do? 
And I'm not even joking, and I don't even care. But you know what you should do? If you see a scalper, you should do what that other guy did. That basically, uh, he, he gave the scalper an address to meet up to, to sell the PS5. And he told the scalper, okay, listen, here's the address. Uh, come meet me here. I'll, I'll pay it off on the spot. I got, I got the money ready, all good. So the scalper goes there, and the guy actually sent him to a comedy club. And he basically tells, okay, are, are you at the spot? And he's like, yeah, I'm here. Uh, I'm in front of the comedy club. And he's like, okay, so listen, what you're gonna do is you're gonna go inside and tell them that you're selling a PS5 for 1,500 quid or whatever, and uh, you'll get a job there in no time. He just legit send the guy. <laughs> You just legit send the guy to a freaking comedy club. That's what you guys got to do, man. Just like send them to the shady places to get robbed and whatnot. Screw the dude. I have zero empathy for scalpers. Zero. Screw them. Zero empathy, dude. Screw them. I know they've been doing this for years, but like the thing is we can't cave. Like I'm telling you right now, if, if, um, if PlayStation Portugal hadn't sent me my PlayStation, I was gonna try to get it from a store. If I couldn't get it from a store, I just wasn't even gonna get it. It is what it is, dude. Like, I am not going the route of scalping. Screw them, screw them, screw them, screw them, screw them a million times over. Because here's the thing, you buy from a scalper, what warranty do you have? What if your console is defective? How are, you gonna, how are you gonna get it fixed? It's not like you get a receipt from the scalper. It's not like the scalper's got like an operation that's gonna allow you to exchange your console if there's any problems with it. Get your money back? <laughs> Getting your money back from a scalper? Screw him, dude. Screw him. Hope they all die in a fire. Not literally, but you know. You guys get you guys get you guys get the gist of that. <sighs> People are even buying freaking empty PS5 boxes for $500 for me. <laughs> it's just insane, dude. It's just straight up insane. <laughs> but uh, yeah, guys, in regards to the movie, like I said, I'm just looking to, to get um, to get like a good action flick and just enjoy myself. I'm not looking for it to blow my mind. If it ends up being real good, all the better. Would I have preferred the movie to be different? Yes, I would. I would have preferred the movie to just fully take place in Monster Hunter Universe because there's a lot of lore to draw from where you didn't need to bring in like, um, you know, mercenaries or military or whatever those people happen to be in the movie. You know, you didn't do, you need, you really didn't need to do the Isekai thing, in my opinion. I, I get why they do it though. They're trying to make, you know, I've discussed this in, in other streams, they're trying to make the characters kind of like relatable, right? So that uh, for the people that never actually played Monster Hunter before they can go to the movie and they can see like oh these these characters are relatable so like the world has to be explained to them so that the people in the audience uh, can understand without actually having played Monster Hunter but I think there were better ways to go about that there were better ways to go about that there's so many ways to tell a story and I just wish they hadn't gone the Isekai route but other than that it's like whatever dude review for movie yeah sure I'll do a review for the when's the movie coming out by the way like it's is that thing coming out anytime soon? At this point, might just wait for the PlayStation 5 Pro or whatever. The whole launch was such a flop. Dude, here's the thing. Like, I've already seen that, once again, mainstream media is, is like, basically clickbaiting the crap out of everything they can, right? Because that's what mainstream media does. Uh, personally, I wouldn't expect a PlayStation 5 Pro to launch sooner than five years. I think if it launches sooner than five years, or at least four, at least four years, if it launches sooner than four years, then I think that um, the consumer trust on PlayStation is gonna drop like a rock, dude. They can't do it. Like, this is a huge investment for people to get a console, particularly, you know, during a pandemic, people are losing their jobs, people are like financially stressed. And then all of a sudden, like, three, two, three years later, here's another one? I think it's the wrong move. Like, I'll still buy it because I'm a content creator, so it's whatever. It's like a tool for me in, in a certain way. But, like, yeah. I, I don't think they should. Movie got pushed back to next year uh, for, U, uh, for UK. Oh, that means I might not get the movie in December either. Apparently the movie comes out today in Germany. Oh, let me see. Let me see if the movie comes out today in Portugal. Uh, let me see. Uh, 
I don't see it in one of our biggest uh, cinema things. So let me try. Cinemas luz ao mundo. Oh, there's nós, 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 luz ao mundo. Oh, nós is luz ao, is luz ao mundo in Portugal now. Okay. Uh, let me see. Cinema. Uh, wait. Vamos estar entrando nos cinemas com a Rádio Comercial. Rádio Comercial! Nos cinemas dia 3 de dezembro. That basically means uh, in cinemas on the 3rd of December. So that means, yeah. Uh, it's probably there today, but I'm not sure because I couldn't find it. Either way, it's it's already out, so I'll go I'll go and watch it as soon as I can. As soon as I as soon as I can go out, have some time, then I'll go watch it. Should probably try to do it this weekend, maybe. I don't know if I'll be able to though. Plugging social distance for doing an interview with Paul, the director, and it was really good. It answers a lot of questions that have been bouncing around the community. Hope everyone can enjoy the film. You too, Rui. Well, thank you, Sir Serenz Dave Farron. Thank you very much. Tip of the hat to you. Appreciate the support. Thank you. Rui, you think we'll see some Elden Ring info at the In Game Awards? Uh, it is highly probable, but I don't know. I would love to stream the... Um, Actually, screw it. I'm going to try to stream the Game Awards here on YouTube this year. Screw it, dude. I quit. I'm going to try it. I'm going to do my best. Uh, the video is going to get demonetized to hell, but I can't tell you guys helping out with that, so it'll be fine. All of our cinemas are closed here. Good evening, James Smith. What's up? Do you, lol, you still believe Elden Ring exists? Kronos, I love when, when people start talking like, oh, Elden Ring doesn't exist. Like... Here's the thing, you get you guys, just because you don't see a massive marketing campaign behind it, you start believing that the game doesn't exist anymore, dude. From software doesn't do this whole, oh, I'm gonna keep the hype going and the hype going for like friggin' six years. That's not what from software does, okay? When from software announces something, they're pretty close to release. It's just the obviously the pandemic impacted that, so they've been delayed. But uh, from software is gonna release Elden Ring, dude. They're gonna release Elden Ring. I have no problems. I have no doubts there. Ray, how big is the update file? I don't know. It hasn't uh, updated for me yet. It hasn't updated yet. So let's see. Weapons, duels. Boom, 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 boom. Can I actually craft the Fatalis dual blades? Yeah, I I think I got I think I can spare the mats, guys. I think I can spare the mats. I think I have enough. Yeah, I think we're good. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, equip now, and let's upgrade them. Yep, I think I can spare the mats. What do we get from this update? Well, you get the soloable. Um, Solobal, what's what's his name again? <laughs> Solobal Safi Jiva. Um, you get, I, I'm sure we're gonna get like all of the events, and you get the Milo Jovovich event, which is the one that I want to do. So now that I have these, I should be able to swap into my SNS build. I had like a raw SNS. Yep, that works. And I can just. So, Kegrin, how important is Marathon Runner? Do you run Marathon Runner for duels? Because, you know, I don't play duels. I have no idea what I'm doing. Uh, let's augment them for lifesteal. I'm just going to go raw dual blades. I'm going to learn raw dual blades real quick. Uh, augment. I think Miyazaki's playing Demon Souls right now. I hope he is, dude. It's. I think, I think Demon Souls is a really good game. Again... Like, a lot of people were criticizing, like, when I was streaming here on YouTube, dude, I was so surprised. People coming into my stream saying the game looked like crap, and I'm just like... What are you talking about? No, Marathon Runner's not good. You don't need stamina skills? Okay. That sounds good to me. <laughs> 
So I just need whatever decos I had in that sword. Uh, let's take a look. What are the decos that I had in that sword? Uh, it's the True Fatalis sword. Oh, that should be fairly easy to see. It's two red boys. Challengers plus four. All right. Set that goes. Challengers plus four. Do, 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 do. Challenger plus four. Now let me really quick look at this build because I don't even know what I have. So we got full critical eye, full agitator, attack boost, evade window, maximum might. It's a good thing I looked at that. It's a good thing I looked at that. I don't think maximum might is going to work for us, Rui. I really don't think it's going to work. I just have this, this feeling in the back of my head. Somehow, I don't think that's going to work. Okay? It's just this gut feeling that I have. I don't think that's going to work out for us. So we need something else that comes with tool specialist. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Uh, where is... Full specialist. What can we get with that? Um, do I already have brace? Yes. Uh, tenderizer we have. Draw, handicraft. I guess we can get handicraft, but meh. Throttle, phoenix. Do I not have phoenix? Oh, I guess I could get one phoenix. I could get one Phoenix, that'd be nice. Phoenix. And then... what? No, it needs to have Maintenance Destroyer. Flawless? Do I not have Flawless? No. Well, I guess we're getting Flawless. Flawless. I probably won't be able to maintain it, but what the hell? Flawless, flawless, one more flawless. Wait, do I have enough tool specialists now? Yes, I do. Flawless. That leaves me with one open spot that I can just put in. Uh, we have evasion and rock steady. Yeah, that works, that works. I'll just put in an Andy Craft or something. Whatever. There. I made a dual blade set. The one thing you guys never asked for, and you definitely didn't want, but I definitely made it. I'm gonna name this set Milla. In order of the Moss Hunter movie. There you go. There you go. Boom, done. The update's already on Steam. Oh, right! Claw Boost, dude! Yes, 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 yes! That's even better! It's so much, but such a good idea. Claw boosts. Watch claw boosts. The shaver jewel. Oh yeah, dude. I love that. Can we craft Fatalis size with this update? I don't know. We're about to find out. Uh, people are saying it's already live on Steam. It always goes early on Steam, dude. Steam, I, I feel like Steam is like just breaking street date, dude. It shouldn't be illegal. They shouldn't be allowed to do that. Don't need shaver with dual blades. Well, you don't need handicraft either, so... I know you don't need shaver, but it's not a bad idea. Between the shaver and the handicraft, I prefer the shaver. Let me just test out. Because we're probably going to get the, the thing late, as always. So I might as well do something just to test it out. Uh, I don't want to go something too hard. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. farewell to Zenogre. <gasps> this is the one that that drops the the thing. Oh hell yeah, dude! Hell yeah, dude! Let's go whale on on Zinzin. We gotta go whale on Zinzin. Is the session full? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> I'm not surprised that it's already up on Steam. It usually takes a little bit longer uh, in consoles. So it's not particularly surprising. Uh, let's go Meat Black Belt. That works. Bada bing, bada boom. Were you gonna watch the Monster Hunter movie when it comes out? Hell yeah, dude. I said I was going to. 
I will consume just about anything Monster Hunter related. Oh yeah, let me turn off this light. You guys should still be able to see me. All right. That light is really bothersome. I can barely see anything. Work on you playing now on your PS5? Yes, yes I am. One point five gigabytes? That's a lot of voice acting, dude. That's a lot of voice acting. Ready for a thirty minute late patch? I'm always ready for a thirty minute late patch, dude. Baron, let's go. Is this going to be like Geralt Quest with a predetermined armor set? I believe that will be the case. Now that mention it makes sense for them to go all out with... Oh, dude, you, you want to know another really funny thing that I found out yesterday? Uh, well, not yesterday, the day before. You guys know how I put out that video and I said that one of the problems that I have with the controller because it's white is because you can see the gamer grime on it. If only I because, you know... Be so grossly incandescent. Wait... Didn't show up for if me. only I could be so grossly incandescent. Why isn't it showing up on YouTube? It's not notifying. What the hell? That's not normal. Give me a second. Why is it not working? Can you cross gen PS4, 5, and PS, uh, PS4 and PS5? Yeah. That's what we're doing right now. Egren's still on his PS4. Uh, I'll give you a shout out after the quest. I'm, I'm really sorry. There was uh, something wrong. I don't know why YouTube has recording at the notifications. Oh god. Such a casual with dual blades. No! Let me do it! Ah, bro. Whee! It's Beyblade! <laughs> ah, sorry guys, I'm here for the Dragon Bane Coals. That's all I care about. Ow. Okay, fine, be that way. Oof! So evil! the material here. I'll take that. Thank you very much. Dude, I gotta do this quest like a crap ton. This quest is legit one of the best quests in this game right now in terms of farming. And if you don't believe that, you're crazy. Excuse me, sir. I'll be picking this up, and... Ooh, I'm almost out of stamina. I'm not used to actually using stamina. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Who's a good boy? Oh crap, I lose. I didn't realize I would lose. Um... God damn it. Do I not have brace? Oh no, what I don't have is demon mode. Sorry guys, I'm not used to dual blades at all. I'm not sure if you can tell. Guys, I'm a dual blades main now. That's it. Uh, did he drop something? He should have dropped. Oh right, I'm forgetting something very important for the dual blades. Oof. No. It's L2.
Wait, how do you do it? Oh, like that. Okay. It's time to do my uh, Dual Blades Crash Course. You guys think I'm still in time? I think it's never too late to start Monster Hunter, so I think I should be in time to do my Dual Blades Crash Course. I almost wish Circle would have invincibility frames, but that would be so friggin' broken. Bring it on! I'll just life steal through it like a boss. Five invincibility windows, so nice. I have a vague window, sorry. This is very good practice for the middle quest. Hey, this is a pretty fun weapon, man. Damn shame I never played it before. This is a pretty friggin' fun weapon. Want another one? Yeah, you do. Yeah, that's right. Mess him up, boys. That's what's up. I could have caught a lot more shinies, but I was a little bit too excited messing around with dual blades. <laughs> I'm basically watching Attack on Titan right now. Yeah, dude, that's what it's all about with uh, with the dual blades. You're basically, um, what's his name? Uh, Captain Levy. Levy, here you Why is Stream Elements not working tonight? Come on, Stream Elements. Don't let me down, my dude. Don't let me down, my dude. Um... Somnier88, thank you very much for becoming grossly incandescent. Tip of the hat to you. Appreciate the support, dude. Thank you very much. And Zizok Imre, thank you very much for becoming grossly incandescent. Tip of the hat to you as well. Really appreciate it, guys. Thank you. Thank you very much for the support. Rurikon copying is not going much better. Really? You downloaded already? Okay, let's see. Check for update. Ooh. 
That's actually uh, reasonably faster than we usually get it. Nice. Show me! Uh, I'm actually going to have to close the game in order to do the update. Just take all of these. Save the game. Yep, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Weed blades. You had to do the shot. I just did them, Roopsing. I just did them. Urkan, have you met their gamer yet? He's basically the smoothest player in Monster Hunter World. Iceborne, I'm real. Dude, I've I've seen his videos, dude. I I told him because the other day he, he asked me for something on, on Twitter. We had a we had a chat and that basically the first thing I told him is like, look, dude. Listen, uh, we'll talk about the thing you want to talk about, but let me just tell you right now, okay? If I ever get a green screen, I'm stealing uh, the way that you do your face cam. That's literally the first thing I tell I'm like, dude, if I get a green, green screen, first thing I'm doing is stealing the way you do your camera. I really like his, the way he does his camera. It's really cool. But yeah, I've seen I've seen Dear Gamer's videos. He does, he does a lot of really chill videos. I really like his stuff. Did someone say Mila Jovovich? Yes, yes, dude. It's coming. Uh, oh yeah, let me save the game. Uh, save. And close. Carved an egg from Zenogre's mouth. Yeah, dude, that's extra valuable because it came from Zenogre's mouth. Uh, check for update. Should take me to downloads. It's downloading right now, six minutes, and then we can get started. Somebody said it was one and a half gigs. I guess that was for PC uh, because of the Ultra HD textures. Dude, I can't wait for them to update this for PS5. Dude, I really want to see what it's capable of because my PC can't handle... Um, it can't handle the visuals of Moss Hunter uh, at 4K. It can't handle it. Oh, dude, we still have the same thing? We still have, like, the same issue with servers? Come on. Go faster. Zoom, zoom. Also, I gotta do something real quick. Oh, I've been trying to format this computer for my father all day. It's actually good. What the hell? Dude, I can't download it. What the hell? Did I just lose connection? Uh, oh, I can still go to the store. It's still working. Oh my god. 99 hours left? What are you smoking right now, dude? Ah, it's broken. Come on. Oh my god, I can't download the update. My update was blocked at 199 megs as well. Interesting. Is something going wrong with this? Okay, now it's working. There we go. Just pause it and resume it a couple of times. Well, don't do it now. Wait until I finish downloading so that I use up all the server bandwidth, and then you can start pausing and resuming like I did, okay? But don't do it right now. Now you wait. You wait until I download. <laughs> Streamer privilege. You got the good server and screwed it. No, no, no. I got the good server now. Um, Mike, you got the Xbox One X? How's it, not the One X, the Series X? How's it working for you? Like, I've heard that uh, Gaijin is like super happy with his Series X, which makes me super happy, personally. Like, uh, even as someone that uses, play, like, a lot, I, a, a lot of times I see this kind of like console wars type of stuff happening, right? There's a lot of uh, animosity between both sides. Me, I'm just like, dude, the better the Xbox is, the better it is for everybody. Right, like, why would you want another console to not be successful? 
the more successful the Xbox is, the better it is for you as a PlayStation customer because PlayStation will want to work extra hard and vice versa. The better the PlayStation does, the better it is for, for you as an Xbox customer because Microsoft will want to work extra hard. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Julian. I'm really sorry. You weren't able to squeeze one during Black Friday? I don't know if you guys have Black Friday where you live. Work on how can you transfer your save file from PS4 to PS5? Easy. Uh, you go... It's like, it's basically the same thing as you had on your PS4, right? You have your save and data. Save data PS4. You go to cloud storage and all your saves are there. Just download it. It's fine. I don't like the fact that they're separate, to be honest. I talked about this in my video. I'm not a big fan of the fact that they're separate. Because, like, basically, with Moss on World, you're still playing a PS4 game. You're still playing a PS4 game at the end of the day. Copying 42%. Actually, I should be able to see it if I press this, right? Yeah. Perfect. <laughs> I still don't have either system. They're impossible to... Yeah, dude, friggin' dude, and, and here's the thing, okay? So scalpers are scumbags, right? 100% agreed. Scalpers are scumbags. They deserve whatever's coming for them. But like, dude, some delivery people, like seriously, I've seen some videos of delivery people just straight up chucking a console onto a porch. Like, what the crap, dude? What the actual crap? Moss on a Rise coming to PC is true. I highly doubt it, kickers. I know that that was supposedly that's part of the leak, which I don't like discussing that particular leak because I don't think the Moss Hunter team deserves all their hard work leaked. But um, it's like, and by the way, the people who perform that leak, scumbags as well. But um, it's like, I highly doubt it because, uh, particularly because people have this tendency whenever there's a, a game that the visuals are not up to par, people go like, PS2 graphics, they're already doing that to Moss Hunter Rise. Like, I've seen so many Twitter posts of people saying Moss Hunter Rise is PS2 graphics. And that's actually one of the reasons why Capcom probably doesn't want to port Rise to the home consoles. Because people are going to look at it and gonna be like, well, what the fuck? I played Moss Hunter World, looked amazing. Now I'm playing this? What's this? A lot of people give too much importance to graphical fidelity. Yeah, see, John the Hunter, I don't know. I haven't followed that whole situation. I know that we got scalpers, we have uh, corona issues, we have a million different things. I'll tell you something, though. I'm super disappointed about what's happening right now. Like, copying is still super slow. Even on the PS5 hard drive, that should not be the case. But that could be because, like I said, Monster Hunter still doesn't take full advantage of the PlayStation 5 proprietary technology, so, yeah. Oh yeah, but I was telling guys a story earlier, I ended up not finishing, but um, the other day, I did my video talking about the PS5, and I said, like, one of the things that bothers me about the controllers, because it's white, uh, after a while you can see the gamer grime, and here's the thing, I said in the video, doesn't matter how much you, doesn't matter how much you wash your hands, Everybody sweats. Like, literally, everybody sweats. If you don't sweat, you have a problem in your hands. Or, or some kind of a weird condition in your hands if you don't sweat. And it's like, you can have the cleanest hands in the world if you're standing in one spot, just like basically gaming for like three hours straight, you're gonna sweat. Your controller's gonna get gamer grime. You have no idea the amount of comments all of a sudden came out of the woodwork of people going like, I don't sweat from my hands! I'm like, yeah, you're the cleanest motherfucker in, in the building, I bet. You're the cleanest bastard in the building, sure. You don't sweat from your hands, yes. Go put your hand up against the window. Did it leave a mark? Well, what's that? If you don't sweat, it shouldn't leave a mark. What's the problem? It's like, some people, dude. Some friggin' people. I was, I was like, what do you mean you don't sweat? If you game for three hours holding a controller, you're gonna sweat. It's If you don't, there's something wrong with you or something different. I don't know. But it's like, dude, that's that's not normal. Everybody sweats. 
I was like, yeah. So many people are like, you just gotta wash your hands. I'm like, you, if you wash your hands, you stop sweating? Is that how that works? Okay. <laughs> people who bitch about the graphics and Rise need to have their expectations in check. If it's a good game and you have fun, who cares? Yet, dude! A hundred percent. Like, look, here's the thing. I like pretty visuals as well. Like, I love playing Demon Souls because it's a fantastic game. And now it looks a lot prettier than it used to. So it makes me want to play it more. Of course. Yeah, it does. Yeah, sure. Graphics are great. But ultimately, what really matters to me is gameplay. Like, there's a reason I have so many hours of gameplay. And I've streamed it so many times for Moss Hunter Generations Ultimate. It's not the most visually good-looking game. But I love it. And I'll tell you what, I would play Monster Hunter 4 Ultimate a whole bunch too. Even if it even if it had the 3DS graphics, but I could just like play it on a big screen. It could have it could be like all friggin' full of jaggies and shit. I wouldn't care. So long as I could play it on the big screen. Cause like I get too tired of playing on the tiny ass 3DS screen. Bon dia Vin Chalish. Thank you, Pedro Mata. Bon dia. Bon dia no bon noite. <laughs> Good visuals are great indeed. My favorite version of Tetris is still the Game Boy version, dude. But the Game Boy version of Tetris was really good, dude. Really good. Why don't the chumps who complain about Moss on Rise graphics wait two or three years for the next main game? Exactly. Exactly. Just wait. Moss Hunter games before Moss Hunter World should take criticism about graphics, though. Why? 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 Like, who cares? Are they good? Are they good games? Do they have like a legitimately satisfying gameplay loop? Who cares? Literally, who cares? And if anybody does care, very simple. Don't play it. Leave it for the rest of us. We're sorry to see you go, but we'll continue enjoying it. Because you, you guys better believe, okay? You guys better believe. I don't give a flying fuck about the graphics of Rise, okay? When Rise comes out, you can expect a flood of live streams and videos and guides just like it happened with Moss on the World. You can expect that. And I don't care if 10 people watch it or if 10,000 people watch it. I don't give a damn, dude. I'm playing the crap out of Rise. You can bet money on it. You can bet cold, hard cash. When Moss Hunter Rise comes out, that's all I'm playing. Dude, I even told my, my friend over at Nintendo, I told him like, so you're aware that you're going to sell a crap ton of Switches come March, right? He's like, why? Because there's new Monster Hunter. What do you mean? <laughs> We're kind of hearing about what's going on at Bioware. Nope. No idea. What's going on, Wishbone? With Bioware. Tell me more. Let me up. I don't like playing games with that big ass light in my face. Rise will be amazing and I like the look. Yeah, I like the look too, dude. Is Nintendo the same company as Xbox? No. Microsoft is Xbox. Play as Artemis from the movie Monster Hunter. Complete two event quests for special bonuses. Content only available in Iceborne. And after you've played, make sure to see the new film. Oh, we will. Oh, wow, dude. They're not joking around. There's like just legit something on the goddamn home screen of the game. They're really not joking around with this. Playing on PS5? Hell yeah, dude. Hell yeah. Be ready for Chungus Rathalos. Dude, I can't wait. Uh, but I think first it's Black Devils. Dude, Black Devils with dual blades? What a goddamn nightmare. Like, give me a lance or something. Give me a friggin' lance. Rocking that top, top lit dome shine again tonight. Hey, don't call me bald! I don't give a damn. <laughs> if I gave a damn, I'd stream every day like this.
Urkan, do you think they'll release more gameplay about Rise? Dude, they've been releasing gameplay about Rise like every single day. I just haven't covered it. Still don't know what it is, but Rurikan's attitude about not giving the fuck is so pleasing for some reason. Well, thank you. Thank you, King. I appreciate that. Uh, okay, let's see what we got. Um, first and foremost, people asking what does this update bring? It brings a solo scalable Safi Jiva and pretty much every event quest under the sun. Assume the role of Artemis from the new movie Moss Hunter and enjoy an original storyline. This original story is single player and it features two event quests. Once both event quests are completed, you'll receive a special collaboration bonus. Both event quests are only available for a limited time, so don't miss out. After you play, make sure to see a new film. Dude, you've only told me to see this movie four times since I've logged into the game, minus the announcement that you guys made on the website. Jesus, I get the idea, Capcom, right? I get the idea. <laughs> oh, and they put it on the top! They put it on the very top! Dude, look at that! They're on the very top. They only require Master Rank 1? Wow. Okay, so the reason they put it Master Rank 1, they want to appeal to as many players as possible. I'm very curious to see this. <laughs> um, so, a ranger. Looks like I'm back in this world again, but where... Are those two I guess I better go look for them I'm back in this world again so that means she's been in monster hunter world before interesting why is that thing still alive I thought we killed it does that mean I'm in the at any rate I need to find the way back to my world okay well story guided content let's go check it out I'm actually gonna put the, the volume a little bit higher so that we can all enjoy the content. There are special rules in Monster Hunter Movie Collaboration event with the Monster Hunter with the New World. Players will assume the role of Artemis. You can only use quest-specific equipment. All items obtained will be discarded, except for quest rewards. Food effects will be lost upon departing on the quest. The quest will not count towards weapon usage or monster size. Oh! No gold crown Rathalos for you! Or slay stats in the guild card, poses and gestures cannot be used. Upon completing the, que the event quest, to our world will become available. Please note that the movie Moss Hunter has been given a rating of 16 by the film publication board. However, the contents of this Artemis Moss Hunter movie quest are keeping with the rating level for the main game, which is 13 and suitable for age 13 and up. <laughs> wow, dude, they're really making a big deal out of this. Like, dude, I'm expecting something on the level of The Witcher at this point. Okay? I'm expecting something on the level of the Witcher. Anything anything less than Witcher levels of questing right now? Completely unacceptable, okay? There's something weird about the eyes Wait, of the model. Where are those two? That particular line of dialogue is like meh. I think I can work with this. <laughs> the Admiral. Isn't that? Artemis comes equipped with dual blades and a number of items. Make sure to prepare in the camp before setting off in the camp area. You can access the following facilities: item box, supply box. You can change your weapons. Okay, you can play charge blade if you want to. 
Uh, change equipment. Okay, yeah, it's just like The Witcher. Uh, where's supply box? Okay. Ooh, a bunch of max potions and two easy large bomb barrels. All right. Scout flies, huh? Let's see where they go. Let's see what our mill is skills. <laughs> Milla, what is this? What is this, Milla? Come on. Earplug stun resistance, health boost, recovery up. Poison resistance, blight resistance, and two levels of peak performance? Do, do, do the weapons even have, like, health regen? They don't. Milla? What is this gear, Milla? What happened? Oh, no. Absiros. They weren't this friendly before. Well, there's no need to pick up items because they're going to be discarded anyway, so... These Wait, waters. I need... I need, uh, Don't honey. Don't monsters in them. Thank God. Okay, this still has at least my weapon hmm. wheel. Doesn't seem to have a nest inside. I better steer clear just in case. I've never seen a mushroom like this. Dude, the voice acting, I'm going to be real, it's not very good so far. Like, it just seems like she's she's edible? reading. Has she done voice acting before, or has she just acted? You don't look very friendly. What do you mean they don't look friendly? They're the guys around here. They're the Gajalakas. What do you mean they're not Move friendly? Aside. I reckon Rurikon has a crush on Mila. No, not really. I guess no matter where you go, stones are stones. I just wanted to see what she looked like when she was mining. <laughs> yeah, but it's like I feel like in the movies she. She does a decent enough job, but I, with the voice acting, I'm really not feeling her voice acting. I don't know. Tell me if I'm wrong in chat, but I'm really not feeling the voice acting right now. Like, you need... I feel like you need more emotion. You need more context or something. It just feels like she's literally just phoning it in. But, you know, then again, pandemic. Who knows the conditions that they had for recording these lines. Diablos. So she has earplugs for, and it can't stop the Diablos. Oh, what good is it then? This is a weak ass Diablos. Hiding in the sand, huh? To sound. We have mantles. It's Beyblade. Their character is actually really well animated. I feel like they did some extra animation. Don't think I'm going down so easy. Got stuck, little buddy. Ah, oh, you prick bastard! Good son. Hey, calm down. Got 
Oh, he is weak. She is weak, dude. This Diablos is mega weak. We already broke a horn. What? Come over here, devils. Let's have a party. Trash talk that we can't really back up because I don't know how to I don't know how to play dual games properly. Come on, Dibbles. Stop playing hard again. Oh, that helped a lot. Oh. See, the screams are good, though. The screams and the grunts... Charge. I'm not sure if I've ever seen somebody do that one. God damn it. I'm so not used to having low stamina anymore. It's so easy to get used to the fatality set. Take you on by I'm trying to get a mount. I don't know if this attack even does that much mounting damage. God damn it! I always knock her down with blade dance. Run, Milla! Run! I don't think I'm going down so easily. God damn it. She waited the exact time she needed to. Oof! Why didn't you change weapons? Because I figured it'd be more thematic for me to do it with the dual blades. That's the weapon she's going to be using in the movie. to say healing potions don't taste good?
Amida Sinovic. Good. You made it back too. Sverai, Shisodore, Kui, Zenetore, Po Doro. What's wrong? You can speak my language. I know you can. E. Kidamich, Dimio. Dude, for a second, my mind just went Gormagala. Where's her grappling hook gonna land? He's gonna like ram it through the dude's ass. A chocolate! A thank you gift left in the camp by Artemis. Bring it to the smithy for a nice surprise. We'll bring both of them to both of the rewards to the smithy when we're done with the quest. New music has been added to your room's music player. New expression, expression 27 has been added to your guilt card. They should just stab in him. Exactly, dude. Watch clawing onto a hunter? Probably not a very pleasing thing. Admiral just clenched. <laughs> Maybe. You never know. Okay. I've been waiting for you. Let's go for the second one. Mela Javovich. So it's not Mila, it's Mela. M Milla. Oh yeah, because it's two L's. You know that up until today I thought it was one L. I'm so sorry. The quest should reward movie tickets. It would have to be a lot harder for you to actually earn like a tangible reward. Ah, uh, players assume. Uh, so this is the same stuff. This is the same stuff. Yeah, it's the same stuff. Derpy Mudkip, I'm gonna check this smithy once I complete both quests. So that we get to see what uh, we get from both of them. Damn, she's got some gnarly wounds on that arm. Wait! That thing was the Rathalos from before, but we killed it. Why can't you understand me? <laughs> Not a two. Uh, this is going nowhere. I've been taking notes. Neki To Gidaningozo Gan Skiro Vipet Truti Ari Nada Or Sumi Lazarus. Me. Me. Zero. No. Senior. Zara. She's on the way. I like how the admiral doesn't have uh, a clutch claw. He thinks I'm part of the Fifth Fleet. If he can't understand me. That means... 
So the movie connects directly the with the new world. In the past? Wait, this is not okay. Damn. Fine, I'll track it down. She said in the past. Like she went back in time? So it's not only isekai, it's it's time travel isekai. Does that still count as isekai or is it just time travel? I don't know. <laughs> I should listen for its roar and confirm its position on the map. Area 1 looks promising. Really we're going to area 1? Okay, fine. These scout flies are smart. Yeah. They're very useful, as it turns out. That was the Rathalos we already took down. And the Admiral doesn't remember me. He also can't speak my language. Does this mean... So, she go it's Isekai and time travel. This is really weird. <sighs> Sin 13, uh, I don't have this game. This out later. I have to locate that Rathalos first. I don't have this game, but is it, uh, but I've been considering. But is it worth this late in the game's life? Sin 13, it's always going to be worth it for you to get Moss Hunter World. Because it's the best game in the world. Like, that's it. You can play... Mo Actually, right now, you can play pretty much all of the experience solo. So, yes, it's definitely worth it for you to play Moss Hunter. All of the events are going to be up. So, you can experience everything that everybody else experienced. And there's probably going to be a lot of people uh, redoing some of the event quests. So, I think right now, it's almost like there's never been a better time Found to play Moss Hunter. World. It's definitely the same Rathalos. If you're just starting up. I know we killed it. So if it's alive here, then I'm definitely in the past. So yeah, there's time travel on top of the second. Hey! I located the Rathalos! It's here! He made you! Come on! Hurry up and help me! Lutina. Oh my god! He's still not getting through to him. <laughs> Look at the signs of this guy. What the hell? Damn. I still have herbal medicine here. Nice. God. Jesus Christ. This weapon just has no reach whatsoever.
good to be able to slam him. Should just have enough of eight. Got some fight in you. I can ram him into a wall, but oh, actually, he's in a good position now for that. I'll try. Oh, well, I can't right now because he's in rage. No, he gives you an opening every time you clutch. Like, you see how he kind of looks at you sideways? They made his AI slightly different from regular Rathalos. But when you clutch. That's the thing, considering how big he is, like almost anything will wall bang. I believe she complains about the taste of a health potion. Potion that can bring you back literally from the jaws of death. She's like, I don't like the taste. God. Oh, that helped a lot. Damn. Okay, he's not enraged again. Turn around. I thought he was gonna go for the double. Let's try it. Should be able to get him. Ah, oh, come on! No! <laughs> that can't be the end. Is it running away? Storm. Now I can return to my own world. Hey. My eating so weak. Up for next time. 
seen me. Huh, paradox is the last thing we need right now. Okay. Kiyo! And be nicer next time. Oh! Bro, Hunter already just flies a friggin' yeah, wyvern know. into the storm. Artemis's notebook. A notebook containing words from this world and Artemis's world. Bring it to the smithy for a nice surprise. I thought that was pretty fun. It's not like it's going to be something that's going to blow everybody's mind, but it was pretty fun. Is that it? Well, I mean, what do you expect? Do you, do you realize the amount of work that it is to just, like, get all that voice acting in there, do all of that animation work in the middle of the pandemic? I thought it was all right. Like, I wasn't expecting to be mind blown by this particular event. I do think they hype it up too much. That is the problem. They do hype it up way too much. They make it like into this big deal when it's really not. It's just a cool event. So let's see. Forge equipment, armor, Artemis Alpha. They give you the exact number of chocolates to craft the Artemis Alpha. Uh, and I'm assuming we can get her layered armor, right? Here it is, Artemis. Artemis's notebook. Yep, this is her layered armor. That's not what I had in mind. I thought my character was going to look like Mila. <laughs> I thought my character was going to look like Mila. What the fuck? Can you not craft a full armor set? Oh no! <laughs> no, that's, that's, I did not sign up for this. That's, uh, yeah, that's not what I wanted at all. Like, I wanted her model. Nice ass, Marie. Hey, I'll take compliments where I can get them, dude. I'll take all the compliments I can get. I ain't ashamed of it. I don't give a damn. You like that ass? You could have one just like it if you didn't ruin yours. <laughs> okay, let's craft this. 
So I see where he raided Miller's Miller's closet. <laughs> No, I really thought we were gonna get like her full model. Like what? I'm a little bit disappointed. Work fast, you slack -tots. Heavy rain. All this boring stuff for a skin, dude. It's it's a promotional event for the movie. I'm not sure it, what we, what you were expecting. Like I thought it was fine. I thought it was fine. I liked it. I wasn't particularly impressed by it, but I liked it. I think Mila is only for female characters. No, you can you can get, you can get it. Weapon art pendant. Oh right, right, right. I should check that. Um, just craft these. You should be able to forge your weapons, right? Let me see. Tool plates. Guild Palace Sabers... No? There's nothing new. You can't forge your weapons. And there's no new pendants. Here's what it looks like on a female. Still doesn't look like Mila. It looks like your character. But Mila's character is thinner. She's much more slender than the, the female hunter. But yeah, it looks all right on a female hunter. On the male hunter, I don't know how I feel about it. Like, let's just remove the wig. <laughs> uh, let's give me the thermi. Yeah, yeah, that 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 doesn't work too well for a male character. I don't think that works too well for a male character. The legs... The legs just kind of don't work, dude. They're, you can clearly see this was made for a female, straight up. Combine those pants with something else? I don't know. You look like Hawkeye Rurikon. Discount Sauron? <laughs> Looks a little off on the male model. Yeah, 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 yeah. It doesn't look... It doesn't look very good. On the female model, it looks alright. You can see Wada's character here. On the female model, it looks alright. But on the male model, it just doesn't have the same curves. So, naturally, it's not going to look as good. It's clearly an armor design for females, which is fine. But still, I'm glad that they allow the male characters to equip it as well. You know. The book is for the layered. That chest looks aesthetic, though. Yeah, the chest looks nice. Wait, let me uh, actually zoom in on it. Let's go. Let's go outside because we don't have a long ass loading screen. It's actually real nice. Look, it can go faster, dude. I really hope that Capcom patches it for PS5. They come up with a pa with a PS5 patch. That'd be so nice. Thing is, I don't know if they're gonna do it, considering that they did a brand new game for DMC. I wouldn't be surprised if they made a brand new game for Monster Hunter. Wait, let me actually... Yeah, I can just use... Oops. I'm used to the Demon Souls view mode now. Uh, where is it? View mode. Yeah, that chest piece looks good. The textures on and stuff, they look cool. The pants is the part that doesn't really work. Man, but I just wish they would let you play with Mila's model. It's like, that's what I thought we were gonna get, but no, we got just the armor set for Artemis.
Can you show guild cart? Sure. Show you guys everything. Everything you want. Uh, view. Wait, no, I have to edit it. Edit. Background. Cinematic world. This is the place where they hit the, um... Okay, Legendary Black Dragon, that, this is all fatalis. I, I don't check the card often, as you guys can see. So you get Cinematic World. Completed quest in New World. Uh, and we had Poses. Du, du, du. I believe there's probably titles as well. So-called. Tank. Eh. If there were titles, I wouldn't know which ones they were. <laughs> I wouldn't know which ones the titles were. Um, where is Edit Pose? Pose. Skilled Hunter. This is the Tony Ja stand, right? This is definitely the Tony Ja uh, stance. Look, Kegrin, here's your new, um, here's your new guild card thing. Comes with a bow and everything. Have the rotating festival started? Yes, they have. Courageous Hunter. This is the Milla. <laughs> it looks terrible on my character. It looks so bad on my character. Look at that. Wait, you can move it? Oh, right. You can position it. But you can't rotate it. Yeah, it's actually a great sword in, in the game. Because in the movie poster, it was pretty damn small. I like that there's actually movement in the beard. I hadn't noticed that before. Because like on the PS4, you couldn't see the detail. But there's actually movement on the beard. When you move your character around. Dude, there's a new expression too. Uh, wait, you mean expression? Let's see. The old card. Edit. There's the expression. Oh yeah, expression 28. Cannot be selected now. So I'd have to change my pose. Uh, okay, tell you what, let's do this. Now let's change it to... It's just a determined expression, and I guess I have to do... Courageous Hunter for Expression 27. Wait, it changes automatically. Look, <laughs> it's just like looking at the guy. <laughs> oh no, I screwed up my... Yeah, cancel changes, please. Oh, thank you. Oof. For a second there, I thought I was going to lose my guild card. I like the way that I made that one. It's kind of weird that the game tells you bits of the movie, like, seriously. I'm not particularly surprised. Dual Greatswords when? <laughs> can you melt Fatalis Evil Eyes? We can check that for you. I don't think you're going to be able to do that. I think it's too soon for you to be able to melt Fatalis Eyes, but I could be wrong. You can meld VIP tickets. Well, you don't really meld VIP tickets, you exchange them. You can exchange one VIP ticket for another VIP type ticket. And you can meld gold melding tickets as well. 
Um, anyway. Some black corn, fell red claw. We have to go back before the guiding lands materials, so here. No, I don't think you get to. Sorry, my dude. No can do. You want that Fatalis evil eye, you're gonna have to go hunt Fatalis. Next gen dual weapons? <laughs> How about shield and shield? No. Carving knife and carving knife. No, you can't get his eyes. Ah, uh, now Grant, but in the movie she's not a bowgun user. So they had to make her character the same as she is in the movie. Uh, let me see what is on rotation right now. I'm actually curious about one thing. Wait, no, no, no. I have to go to... I have to go to the hall. Let's see how the armor looks dyed. Sure, we can do that. I'm not putting on her hair, though. So the metal bits and the straps don't get painted, everything else gets painted, so you can make like a, a decent fashion set out of it. Oh! And the centerpiece glows the same way that the butterfly set does. So you can get a little bit of glow on that centerpiece as well. Positively fabulous. Did I miss you fighting the event yet? Yeah, you missed it. Uh, it's it's reasonably fast. It's just a Black Diablos and Arathalos. And I did very poorly because I decided to actually take the dual blades instead of taking the easy route and swapping weapons. So I did really poorly in the event, but it was still fun. Um, now I'm curious about one thing. Uh, how are things? Wait, Safi Jeeva Recon? Good to see you. Uh, oh, how did you start Safi Jiva again? I forget. It's not Safi right now, right? Oh yeah, right now we're doing Kolv. If we go to events, Gold Goldilocks is here, the Eternal Gold Rush. Okay, I wanted to test the Safi Jiva, but Safi Jiva is only going to come for two weeks since um, Kolv Tarot just began, so I can't test Safi. And Kulf Taroth was already soloable, so that's not particularly new. But yeah, as you can see, you got all of the events up in here right now. So yeah, there's actually never been a better time to play Monster Hunter if you're someone who's scared of missing out. Like from this moment onwards, you're never going to miss out because you're just always going to have events and they're always going to keep swapping the decorations in the thing. So it's... I actually think it's going to be a really fun time to start for someone that's never played it before. Because, you know, you play the game and then two weeks after you started playing the game, you get, I don't know if it's two weeks or one week or whatever, but basically a little bit after you started playing the game, you're going to get a new gathering hub. And then a little bit after that, another new gathering hub. And it's going to be constantly swapping, so it's pretty cool. Of course the slots are horrible, James Smith. Were you expecting... You, were you expecting the set from this event to beat the Fatalis set? Come on, dude. That was never going to happen. That was never gonna happen. Yeah, you might not want to flare if you want to have some, uh, some challenge. I would also advise people not to use the Guardian armor, because it kind of breaks the progression of the original Monster Hunter. So I'd actually advise you guys not to go down that route. 
But uh, yeah, I think the event was pretty fun. Uh, if you guys uh, enjoyed it, make sure to hit the like on the live stream because it helps out a lot. I'm going to be calling it here uh, because I want to go get some sleep. I just wanted to do the event for you guys. It was really fun. Thank you all very much for showing up today. Appreciate it. Love you guys. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.